Well, now at 430, Princess Cruises announces an additional 66 confirmed cases of the coronavirus aboard one of its ships, which is already quarantined in a Japanese harbor. Now, that brings the number of infected people on that ship to more than 130. At least 24 Americans have tested positive. NBC4's Gordon Tukamatsu has more. This is our room. From the other side of the world, through the magic of technology, Jerry Goldman strikes a cheery tone. The past few days cannot possibly have been easy. I've perfected washing clothes in the bathtub. She and her husband Carl have been confined to their small cabin aboard the cruise ship Diamond Princess for several days now. They are among thousands of passengers and crew now anchored just off Yokohama, Japan. I'm going to get ready to do another load. The sometimes deadly coronavirus is what caused all of this. The Goldmans and everyone else cannot leave until two weeks have passed. That's when Japanese health officials can confirm that none of them have been infected. We do not have the virus. They test us three times a day. We take our temperature. Already, as the Goldmans have exhaustively reported on their daily blog, dozens of passengers have tested positive and are receiving medical care after being removed from the ship. The rest of the folks on board cannot leave. That means the small radio station the Goldmans own here in Santa Clarita has to function without them. Jerry says her staff here has been doing an excellent job so far, and she and Carl have been focusing on the positive things as best they can. They let us go up on the balcony and walk for an hour, which we were very, very grateful for. And they're certainly looking forward to the return trip home. You can follow their journey through the KHTS radio website with daily postings. Just go to NBCLA.com and click on the link provided. In Santa Clarita, Gordon Tokumatsu, NBC4 News.